Sheep Fetters Journal. For today's episode, I'm going to give you another tour. So this is actually part two of my ship tour. If you haven't seen the part one, I'm going to link it here. So now for the part two, a tour around our accommodation spaces or inside our living spaces. So the accommodation space is this white building-like structure that you normally see on a ship. So this is our gymnasium. We have only limited gym equipment, but this is enough. We have some lockers here, stationary bikes, and some of the equipment for building our muscles. We have a treadmill here and speaker. We also have our changing room. This is where we change into our working, yeah, into our working outfit. Those are our lockers. That is my locker. And there are shoes everywhere. And there is also a basin here and a mirror. And that is me in front of the camera. I'm using my DJI Osmo Pocket attached to my phone. Then we also have our medical locker and we have our hospital here. We are lucky because we have our elevator. So let's use our elevator going to the boat deck. So by the way, our ship is a cape size ball carrier. So we have nine cargo holds. It's 292 meters long and 45 meters breadth. Let's go inside our elevator. We have all the elevator stuff here, the buttons. Third deck, second deck, upper deck, boat deck, A deck, B deck, C deck, captain's deck. So these are the living spaces from boat deck to up here. And this is mainly part of the engine. So this is our laundry room. This is where we do our laundry. It's not a it's super good shape at the moment. So we have our dryer and we have the washing machine for linen and for ordinary clothes and for working clothes and then another laundry dryer our drying room so this is where we make some pie our clothes para matuyo there is a heater there common toilet in botek this is our day room Officer's Recreation And this is our Officer's uh, <laughs> And that's the most handsome captain here and the most Handsome also and very energetic chief engineer. Hello. Say hi to my vlog, sir. Hello. <laughs> they just finished dinner, so this is where we norm normally have our dinner for the officers. This is another recreation room for the crew. Say hi! Hello. What? We also have This is how it looks like here. At, as of the moment, they're watching a movie. Adjacent to the crew recreation room, they have the crew mess room here, but it's it's already 7 o'clock, so they just finished having their dinner. Yeah, so we have all the tables here 
Then we have a refrigerator, the rice cooker, microwaves, and all this stuff for the coffee. We have a fountain. This is where we put our food. Now we are going to the pantry and we're going to the galley and then down to the provision store where we keep our food. This is the pantry. This is where mess man would normally wash our dishes. So here are some of the dishes. When I was a cadet, I was a cadet. This is a legit fish room with a huge fish. Thank you! This is the dairy room where we keep our dairy products such as, such as milk, eggs, juices. Yeah. And then we also have bread. Room. This is naman where we keep ang mga bigash, bigashi. Tapos, syempre, from the name itself, vegetable room, we have our vegetables and... Wala na tayong pagkain mo! <laughs> Yan, mga... Gulay. Mga prutas. Lemons. Garlic. Onion. Pineapple. Everything is here. Last but definitely not the least is the meat room. So yeah, and this is the meat room and all of the meats are stocked here. Yeah, and they're all in the box. Those are the meat everywhere, meat.
I hope you guys enjoyed our today's episode. It's pretty much inside our ship. So this is basically where we stay and where we spend most of our time. This is a place where we rest and this is pretty much our home. If you enjoyed this video, give it a thumbs up, comment your favorite part, and do not forget to subscribe to my channel and click the notification bell button to get notified whenever I post a new video. I want to thank everyone for supporting me in this journey. I really appreciate it. Thank you so much for your kind words and for encouraging me to make more videos. So I will do my best to be more creative so that I can show you guys our life at sea. So that's it for now. Till my next vlog. Bye!